when you're old and gray and looking back on your days here, what are, what are the things that are going to come to mind just, first? Um, just everything from the people I met, the relationships I've established, and uh, you know, the ups and the downs of the football, my f football career here, and uh, you know, just a little bit of everything. You know? How, how's Notre Dame been? I mean, was it is it different than you ever expected? What was the whole experience being here? It's it's incredible, you know. And um, I really didn't know much about Notre Dame before I got here. So you know, once I got here, you know, just it's kind of crazy. You just know everything. You know, they you slowly know about the history and you know, Father Soren, New Rodney, all that stuff. It's kind of just put on you. And uh, you know, it's an incredible incredible place. Like I said, and. Uh, you know the relationships and the you know everybody I met here. It's, it's it's undescribable. What's the what's the highlight been? Is there, when, again, when you look back, is there going to be a game or a moment that stands out to you? Um, I don't <coughs> think so. I just think just the whole four and a half, five years that I've had with football, just a little bit of everything. You know, I've seen the lowest of the lows, I've seen the highest of the highs. So um, you know, that's just something that uh, is going to really keep me going. And, from that standpoint, it's got to be pretty gratifying to be where you guys are, considering sure. how low it had been. For sure, you're exactly right. Um, you know, I've seen, we've seen this program, you know, just get better every year. You know, I can remember my freshman year against Snowball Strong, the Syracuse game. So, you know, I think a lot of the freshmen and the sophomores on this team, they really don't remember that. But, you know, that's something that, uh, like, me and D Mac and, you know, uh, Braxton, we all, <coughs> something we kind of don't forget about. And you were coming in here after they had gone three and nine. Yeah. What were your expectations at the time? Um, I actually didn't know they were three and nine because I really didn't keep up with Notre Dame football, getting recruited, really. But, um, you know, I was all about Texas or whatever. But, uh, you know, you know they were 3-9, and nine, but, you know, uh, when Coach Weiss was here, you know, he challenged us to, you know, be a part of that group to help turn it around. So